They opened. Oh my gosh. Shut that there. What's going on? This place, though, is in. Freak. Did it see me? Oh! There's a freaking picture. Are you kidding me? So what is going on guys, this is Ryan here, and welcome back to another episode of Three Random Games. We haven't done an episode on this series for a long time, and I mean, if you guys are new and don't know what it is, let me just elaborate right now. Three Random Games is a game series where, okay, take a breath in, alright, because this may take you by surprise. It's not gonna at all. It is that game series, however, where I proceed to take not one, not two, but three random games and play them all from the... I can't do this intro. I take three random games and play them all in the confinements of one video. The first game we're going to be checking out is called Yet Another Exhausting Day. I think it follows behind a person who's working at a computer all day doing some kind of work and then they proceed to get really tired and this, this game should be called Me, basically. The next game is called Northbury Grove. Looks like a kind of spooky horror game. And then we're going to follow up with something really random and I don't even know what it's going to be yet. With all that said, guys, we're going to hop straight into this one. But if you do enjoy this episode, I mean, uh, I, I think you know exactly what, what to do. Jesus. Oh! Hey, this is pretty cool! So this is yet another exhausting day. Follows behind a person who's apparently tired and you gotta get from A to B. Simple objectives. Alright, let's get this started then. So we can be Susan, Peter, or Bob. Susan sounds fine. What's popping off then, Su- The heck? Uh, a bit close right there. Yeah, she's exhausted right now. Heading off to bed, huh? When the season changes, I always feel lonely. Oh, Susan. <laughs> don't make me feel bad. Come on, we're meant to be having some fun for this game. However, there's a good point behind this. You got that energy drink just to the side of your bed? Is that the however? Uh... I do not want to sleep. It took a long time to say that. Okay, Susan, work on thinking about your vocabulary and what you're gonna say because, uh, you know, conversations with you are probably not gonna be the best, just being real. And here we go! Oh, this game is cool! So, we can move around like so. Uh, did W, A, S, and D do anything? Uh, I don't think so. I click here. We do like a little kind of butt thrust. Alright, look at that, we can charge it up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is cool. So we have to slide along, I guess, avoid all the pillows out. What the freak is going on? Yo, get moving, get moving. Oh, so we're timed on each level. Got it. Better be nice and quick then. So we've got a flashlight there. Does that help with our sense to all? If we shuffle along? Uh, I, I, I don't know what you're doing there, Susan. The freak is going on. Guys, help. I think that actually helped out. So, boost up here. Sense lessens in time, causing you to fall asleep. So basically, get your freaking butt moving to the objective else you're done. Can we boost around corners? Somehow we can? I ain't explaining this. I mean, look, I'm debating right now, Susan. You might already be asleep, you know? This might be that good dream stuff. So, uh, yeah. Got like a bottle of alcohol there. I'll smash that. I don't understand what we're doing right now. So, smash that. All right, so if I hit my head off those, I'll wake myself up. So, by doing some damage, yeah, I'm good again. Uh, okay, look, I'm gonna go with it. So, up the wall we go once again, Susan. Round those pillows. Don't touch it. Uh, wait, what just happened? I just blew up the pillow somehow. Look, no time to think. If I get to the objective, that's all that matters. Good stuff. What's this all about? Into the armchair? Simple enough. There you go. Boost up. Get nice and comfy, I guess. They call me a single dog, so I changed my profile to a turtle. They are wrong. My age qualifies as a single turtle. I don't know why I'm clapping, but guys, clap with, okay? My head becomes heavier, yet I cannot sleep. Still, Susan? Wow, so use the middle mouse button to see further. I have no idea what you mean by see further. I've tried pressing it, it's doing nothing. So if I just bump my head off this a few times, uh, I'm good, I guess. Yeah, that looks good to me. So, headbutt, hold right click, then release. Look, I've already figured that out a long time ago, okay? But objective's right there, and we're good. You kidding me? Next level. Okay, here's those energy batteries right there. Look, that's gonna be some of that good stuff to wake us up, I think. But, what about the stuff? Okay, caffeine helps, that's good. But the pillow's in front. It gives me, like, invulnerability to them, so I don't fall asleep when I touch them. Ah! Well, that makes things a lot more easier. Thank you very much, caffeine. Ooh, now this one's a bit awkward. Okay, Susan, listen, we're gonna work together on this one, all right? But you're gonna have to listen to me. Bed up, stop. Okay, turn sideways, and don't hit the pillow. I like that. There you go. All right, this gives us that time. And just like that. Whoa. Susan, calm down, okay? All right, next objective, straight in front here. And I think right there, we're good again. More of the story or something. Being single for so long, I'm not afraid of sarcasms anymore. I love watching Korean dramas on sofa. My tears fall fast. Perhaps cannot wait to get rid of me. Again, just, just clap, guys. I don't, I don't know. I really don't know. Act three, I'm gonna brand this one. It seems like we've got these checkpoints. My head becomes heavier, yet I still could not sleep. Oh, this time the pillows are freaking moving. Okay, uh, that was a good time boost. And go. 
Let's go. All right, I gotta like head for these things quickly. Go, go. Ah! Oh. Am I good? Oh boy. Okay, I'm good still. I don't know how, but I'm good. This is gonna be slightly problematic. I'm just saying. Okay. So if I hold the boost too long, I like pass out straight away. Guys, this time these pillows are moving. Boost up there. Okay, come on. Keep it going. Ah! That's not good. I think we're good. Okay, okay. Do that again. Okay. This could work out. This could still work. We're gonna go around this good stuff here. Not, not on it. Are you kidding me? I nearly had that 100% zero deaths. And down there? Yep, that's good. Oh yeah, we need no stimulation to keep us awake on this one. Ah, crap, now this one's gonna suck. This is gonna be very difficult. So boost through there. Now, I gotta crack this thing straight open with my head. Keep boosting. Oh, how am I good? I'm not good. That's the reality. Around like that. Oh boy. Yeah, that's how you do it. One more shimmer. Woo! Is this the final level then? One boost that way should do it. Like, if we just wanted to sleep though, isn't technically hitting the pillows like winning the game? Because I don't see it any other way. Either way, story time. I'm so reluctant to help editing my cousin's wedding video. My aunt insisted me sitting with the unmarried. Turns out there was only a bunch of kids. Um, I, I guess I clap again. I, I really don't understand how this just got this way. Like, we're on about turtles one minute, then we're talking about something else. I don't know, but we're sleeping. So nice and quiet. Okay. I, I don't know if, if we won the game or did we? We won. Okay. Finally ended a half a year single life. What? What, from sleeping? Whoa, uh, ooh. That looked painful, I'm just saying. Being single is really not a big deal. At the end of the day, there is always tomorrow. That is very true, Susan. Very true. Always see the good stuff in life. Don't focus on the bad stuff whilst it's happening. You know? And I think with that, that's it. And we're good. Okay, guys, so this next game we're gonna- Northberry Grove <gasps> is a quaint forest community. <clears throat> the serenity and solitude of Northberry Grove is far removed from the chaos and cultural cacophony of Spectre City, just a few hours away. Okay. But on one fateful night, this humble community will be shaken to its core by the harrowing crimes of a cold-blooded killer. Uh-oh. Connor and Crystal are among the dozens traveling to Spectre Forest. They're gonna have Deep regrets. within the woods is the Rock the Warehouse Music Festival. Okay, They've arrived okay. early to get their volunteer passes from their friend, Grace Bailey. Okay. Little do they know, they should have set this one out. Oh my god! It's a horror game, guys. I saw this coming. I think everyone else did as well. It's about experiencing the terror of what these people went through, so let's get it. Ooh, that pulsing synth as well? Okay. So this is pulling through Northbury Grove. Press enter. Yes! I shall. Let's do it. Spectre Forest the night before. This is so cool right now. Like, it's got that olden vibe, and it's working so well. Olden vibe. I, I think, you know, I'm going to go with it. But let's try and establish what's going on down here. You know, we turned up early. What's the problem? This looks cool. This looks very, very cool. So this is Crystal. Let's speak. Grace hasn't picked up her phone in hours. They're probably wasted. Yeah, this is a music festival. We already know what goes down typically at these things. So what's the plan? You following me? Shouldn't you know these trails by now? So we gotta go ahead and find, I guess, wherever this girl is. Let's get a move on. Some light emitting from over here. Let's try and figure out the story of whatever happened at whatever place this is called. I forget the name already. Hello, anyone there? Taxi. You bailed straight into the sign. Uh, hold up a sec. An abandoned car, you say? Abandoned with the lights left on, the door wide open as well. Who would just leave a car running like that? Yeah, that's a very valid point. That's very concerning as well. And uh, you jumping on cars, I see that. Okay, what's this we got here? What does that say? Uh, something was here. I think Dale was here. Doors, uh, yeah, that's gonna be spray paint as well, just a decal. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Okay, we'll pick up this. Okay, your interview is scheduled tomorrow at the Spectre. So, why is someone walking? What the heck is going on? Thanks so much for this opportunity. I really appreciate it. I'm currently headed to the King's Comfort Motel. I will see you tomorrow. Have a great evening. Interesting. Is that Grace's phone? If we can't find Grace, I say we just leave. She always does this. Uh, yeah, Crystal, I like your thinking. Good idea. The motel, you say? Got a small parking lot here. No cars parked up whatsoever. To be honest, for a music festival, I'm not liking the vibes of this place. It's so deathly silent everywhere. Wait, is this a motel? Looks more like a storage area, to be honest. Uh, let me just go in the middle of the road. That might be the motel. Okay, what's this? Some sounds coming from this place here. This is so weird. You know, just everything about this? I don't know. I feel so uneasy. <laughs> this game is doing a weird sense of fear, I'm just saying. Okay, but hold up. The motel is blocked off, so we can't actually get to it. So where else do we go? This area here seems to have no way in, at least to my knowledge. 
looks pretty much gated off, so I guess that's off limits. Couple more places of interest that we can see the light emitting, but I ain't going through the forest to get there. No, you can skip that. I'm playing a horror game about two kids roaming around. We know there's a cold-blooded killer, so I do not want to die, you know? So we're gonna go through this way here. Um, what exactly is that? A monument of some kind? Let's take a look. So, Rock the Warehouse. Campsite open. So this furthers, I think, in toward where the campsite would be. I guess we'll go exploring then. Though we can see this lit path here, so where do we go first, you know? Camping lot A. You know what? This place is lit up, so we should probably investigate this zone first. Then we'll try and establish what we do next out. Guys, this is weird, this sound design. I don't like it. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Here we go. This is a Northbury Ale. This has got to be something, right? Right in here. What is this? What does that even say? Natural Scythian Spirits. Okay. So these are what would be all of the different venues set up, huh? Interesting. Okay, what do we have toward this side here? We've got two more porta pies. Let's open the doors. Okay, nothing in that one. Let me check that one. Uh, yep, glad I can't flip this here. So what is the deal with this? I see no killers. I see no issue. Very spooky atmosphere, but that's about it. Why is this locked? Where the hell is everyone? We need to cut this lock. Okay. So now things started to get a little bit weird. Okay, I feel it. Looks like a junkyard though. Or is that where everyone would have parked? But for every single person to have just like disappeared, kind of. Guys. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god, what the heck? Oh! Is that just like the soundtrack that's tripping me out too much, man? Go back where there's light. Should I backtrack or should I go that direction there? I really don't know. Guys, this may be stupid, but I'm running through the forest over to this thing here. Okay, that's the junkyard, so we have already been there before. Okay, so this here looks a little bit like a campsite. A couple of... Heck, there's some noise here. Have I been to this one? Because that sounds like there's people legitimately there. And can you stop staring at me like that, Crystal? Sounds like someone's got a hammer. Is it... Okay, someone's playing some tunes. Should we stop it? I can't stop it. Uh, I don't know what that is. Can't take it. I'm too on edge right now. Okay, there's a fire over here. Must have been fairly recently started to be still going. So we can check this out here. What is this? Okay, I can't see it. We should look around the parking lot. Okay, so we've been there before. The fact that nothing has happened with this game is really freaking me the heck out, man. I don't know what I'm even to be expecting, what the killer looks like or anything like that. I just, I, I don't know, guys. I really don't. Okay, let's come back here, though. An abandoned car. So that's not the parking lot. Is it referring to the one just over here? Wait, wait, wait. Was that open before? Oh, man. Oh, man. Yeah, now we're trespassing. Oh, boy. Jeez, man, I'm too on edge. Okay, calm down. All right, we're here. They shut me in. Who the freak is doing that humming right now, you know? Chris, are you going to talk about this? Nothing at all, just stands there completely bland. Okay, the footsteps in the ambience again. Oh. Okay. Yeah, you can stop. That's freaking me out. Oh, boy. Let's get close. Oh, God. Okay, so we've got a warehouse here. Um, do I really want to be going in here for the bolt cutters? I don't know. But I guess I don't really have much of a choice, so let's just do this. They opened. Oh, my gosh. There's some radio sound in there. Please don't just jump out at me. Please don't. This sort of style of game really scares the heck out of me, man. Oh, man. Ah, come on! Stay with it. It's just a game. All right. Open this here. Dude, if something is pursuing me right now, please specify. Just do something, you know? I want to know if I am being pursued, because I don't know. I don't know if it could be within here. We're looking for a pair of bolt cutters. That's the uh, key item. You scan along these real quick. And, okay, no joy there, unfortunately. What's this here? I don't know. We can't actually interact with it. Okay, let's keep going back. Oh, bro, it's got a second floor. Why has it got a second floor? Shut that there. What's going up? This place, though, is in. Freak. Did it see me? Oh, there's a freaking picture. Are you kidding me? What the heck? Wait, does something see me? I'm so confused. Hold up. Open the door. Uh, I don't know why I did that. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Go, go, go. What the heck is going on? Guys, I don't know. Pull it. I don't know what I did. I need to turn something on. Oh, there's a body bag in here. And there's a person here with me. Get the freak out of my way. Oh, run, run. My voice is completely gone. Okay, look, Crystal, it's a good job you stayed out there, okay? Do you know where I am? Close it, maybe? Okay, I'm inside. Flashlight off. Breathe. In and out. Uh. Yeah, I'm about to turn this game off. What is he doing? Listen. Continuous thumping. Bro, this game is freaking me out. Oh my gosh. I don't know where the bolt cuts go. Don't. 
This is intense. Guys, he's now patrolling. You know what? If he's upstairs, I'm gonna go this way here. So I'll check the entirety of the downstairs. Just watch I got the time, I guess. What's this in here? Uh, fish tank. It's fake. Okay. okay. Loads of boxes in here. Don't really see any purpose other than that. Definitely no bolt cuts hidden away. Oh, man. He sounds so close. He truly... Okay, an old VHS tape. It's... Oh my god! This game is so bad, guys. In like the horror way, you know. You know. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. What am I doing? I don't know what I'm doing. I, I don't know. I'm going upstairs. Okay, this is stupid. I'm trapped. I'm trapped. I'm trapped. Lie off. I'm trapped. I've trapped myself. Ball curves? No. <sighs> He's right there. Okay, so he is kind of polite. Close the door after himself. Mama taught you some manners and her. Just not how to greet people when they need bolt cutters. <laughs> Guys, they're upstairs. These bolt cutter things. I gotta be up here. You know? Okay, I don't know if he's close. All right, we've made it this side here. Wait, you know what? If I was to crouch and turn the flashlight off, does that help me hide? I really don't know. This way here. Close that. Bro, that is the most rusty bath. How do you even achieve that look? Like, you can't even do that if you tried. Yeah. Yeah. You see me again. Okay, uh, that, what, I don't know what that is, I can't pick it up apparently. Oh my gosh. Look at the way he runs, it's like so forceful. Alright, alright big fella, go it. Uh, okay, don't know why I did that, but okay. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Bolt cuts there. Oh my god! Okay, let's get out! I've got the bolt cuts, uh, I gotta get to the car and get out. Okay, wrong room! Ow! Jeez, man. Come on, come on, come on. Stop thinking about it. Okay, uh, I've gone the- I died, didn't I? Okay. We're back, guys. This game is insane. Oh my goodness. Hold up a sec. So, a lock. I need to find the bolt cutters. They're completely randomized each time. I think I said before. So, I have no idea where to even begin looking for these things, you know? They could be anywhere in this place. Definitely not in here. Okay, I'm gonna go downstairs. Oh my god, he's downstairs. All right. I've got a fuse, so we can get the power on. That's over by the upstairs door on the other side. So that's that figured out. But these bolt cutters, I don't know where they are. If they'll be in here again. Yeah, I'm just gonna go for it. Okay, so if he sees me, then I can just kind of get this thing on the go. All right, here we go. This is stupid. Over here, come on. Go through the door. Right, run over here quickly. Okay, so in here. Uh, okay, I have the cat. I need to turn the power on somehow. How do we do that? That's why we need the uh, thing. I think that's the power. So you have to have all three things to progress. That sucks, but also it makes sense. Okay, guys, so I've tried this a lot of times, okay? And I'm just not getting anything from this. Like, for some reason, the bolt cutters, I can never find them. I've noticed you can explore the entirety of the downstairs before he even, like, spawns. They're not there this time, though. All I have right now is the fuse. Uh, can I put that in there, maybe? Of course I can. That's the card reader. So fuse goes in there, but bolt cutters are needed first to use that. Because this was the room where I found them the first time, and I can never find them again. It's uh, almost like they just don't spawn in anymore. <gasps> Whoa! Freaking God, are you kidding me? Straight on that dude's back, mate! They're there. Oh my goodness. Okay, I've got the bolkers. Now I've got to get the heck out of here. Get to the car. Wait, so the bolkers, can I use that downstairs? Or is that not going to work? Is that like a power operated door? Try this. Bro, it's not. History. Oh my God. And the killer's upstairs. Okay, look, we got to go all sneaky on this right now. Okay, Metal Gear Solid 2. Thank you. Right, getting me in the vibe. So upstairs we go. Nice and slowly. I don't know where he is. If I go this way, maybe I'm good. Nice swift dash. All right, here we go. Let's just do this, man. A lock. Gone. Okay, powers. Now on. Throw that in there. Maybe these lights will help a bit. Oh yeah, you bet. Flashlight off. Oh my god, he's right there. Okay, this is bad, this is bad. All I gotta do is run a loop and then get to that door and I think I'm good. Please, come on, open, open. Here we go, I'm good. Guys, what the freak is going on? Uh, this way? Um, am I good? I don't know. Oh my goodness, end here. Where did Crystal go? I hope she's okay. She has the keys to the car. Um. Where was we even parked? I don't even know. Keep running. We broke out though, right? Come on, Crystal. Is that it there? Crystal, please. Holy crap. Is that- Oh my god. She's done for, dude. Thanks for the car key. Oh boy. Can I take him? Okay, so we've took it. Where the heck was the car parked? I can't remember. Oh man. Come on. Think, think, think. There was something else on this road here which led us to our car, but they were all gated off. It can't be that place. But it's got to be somewhere nearby. Either that or I'm going absolutely crazy right now. It's got to be back at the place where we just once was, right? I swear we ran past this thing, I recall. It was within here. Got one car with the lights on there. Ah. Uh, no! He's freaking me. Oh my god. Should we go over here? Maybe it was uh, towards this thing? Yes, this is it here. Okay. Use the bolt cutters there. Alright, and where's our car? I don't know. Try to open. Which one 
is our car. That's all we gotta know. Oh, crap. No, 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 no. Oh my goodness. Crystal, this looks like your type of car. Nope. Obviously not. I've already mucked this up, guys. There's a lot of alarms going off right now. This one here, maybe? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Crystal, which one is it? I'm trying everything, guys. I really am. Nothing seems to be working. This one? This one? This one? Oh, gosh. There's a car there. Is that it? I found a car, so what? It's frozen me. Did we escape? Oh, my goodness me. I committed, guys, and we managed to escape as a result. Woo. There were moments where I thought, Yay. for now. So you're trying to say after all that, I, uh... I might get snapped up again. So I think the only problem I had with this game was my own. I wasn't looking in like the trash heaps. I was always looking in like a cupboard or something for the bulk cutters. I really wanted to beat this game because I love seeing how the horrors always end and knowing you escape, it's just like a personal satisfaction, you know? Wait, hold up. What is this? We thought we escaped? Uh-oh. Hey? The freak is this granny looking crap? We thought we escaped in the car? Our tires must have been slashed. Uh-oh. The void is calling again? What the freak are you talking about? Look at this. Um, I'm none the wiser. Oh boy. Oh, okay. Some kind of decor, I guess. We're not going to talk about it though. But let's walk on through. We will answer it. The void? You going to answer? Oh man, this is a teaser for the next game, isn't it? I'm feeling this. We always answer the void. Good for you guys. Yeah, yeah, good stuff. You see, when you're trapped in a house and you go upstairs, you want to die. So uh, I've accepted something really bad is about to happen the further in here we go. But this is what we do. Because we're not the smartest person in the world, are we? And, uh, yeah. Okay, so this is our final game, guys. Uh, it's called Humpty Deb Dumpty. What the freak is going on here? Uh, will to live meter. We've got things floating around in his head. Do we, uh, do we... <laughs> What what the freak is going on? What do you even do gonna push you off? Could have landed that job. Uh, let's see th this one here. Do I really we... haven't done anything with my life. So we ask him stuff and then the, the egg responds. So it's like the will for Humpty to not, you know, fall off the wall. You must be lonely. It used to be cool. Let's click this one there. Come on, that's gonna be a, a will increaser. Keep my head up high and try not to be sad. Okay. Not the same anymore. Stop being on the fence about things exactly where do you need to be. Uh, I mean, I would make a pun, but this dude looks sad. Try the fence I'm one. Not gonna listen. Okay, enjoy yourself. Yeah, that seems wow. good. Okay. This is a good time. This, th is, it, is it good? I think so. How's it going today? Today is a good day. This seems pretty easy, guys, you know. I'm bringing him back. So high up there, jump off the wall. How'd you get up there? Let's ask him that one. Distraction is good, I right? I wonder how I got here. Okay, what are you? What they say, make it or break it. I have no idea what the freak I'm playing. This is the most bizarre game I've ever seen. See life differently, going to fall down, maybe you should belong up there. No, 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 dude, come on, see life see differently. Here, you know, it's not always gotta be um, rotten. <laughs> One with the wall, don't let anyone let you down. Uh, lots to look forward to. So we gotta bring up the dude's spirit. There might be lots to look forward to, you know? I see that one. So there you go. Yes, yeah, see? Now he's bringing his spirits back up. Greater purpose, that sounds good. Nothing to do up there, such a coward. Let's ask him that one. We're pretty much good. Uh, jump off the wall. How'd you get up there? Let's ask him that. I think we're nearly there. Ask him if he's okay. Come on, dude. We're nearly done. See life differently. I, I don't know what I'm doing. I think, um, th did I just save an egg? You did the right thing. So, um... Yeah, we're gonna end it here. Okay then, guys. Well, that was another episode of Three Random Games. I said before, I didn't plan for the third one, so um, you get what you're given. This was a very fun episode, though, of Three Random Games. The first game I had a load of fun with, and Northbury Grove, the 80s style that it went for, completely sold the atmosphere for me. And when you were trapped and confined to that space, the anxiety was just straight real. We saved an egg as well, so... um. Yeah, but anyway though guys, for this episode of Three Random Games, this is exactly where I'm gonna leave it, and I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, why not drop me that like crate, and hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here. So thank you so much for watching this video, guys. I of course hope you did enjoy, and I will of course see you on the next one.